O God, come to our aid. O Lord, make haste to help us. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Alleluia. Hear the herald voice resounding, Christ is near, it seems to say. Cast away the dreams of darkness, welcome Christ, the light of day. Wakened by this solemn warning, let the earthbound soul arise. Christ the Son, all sloth dispelling, shines upon the morning skies. So when next he comes with glory, shrouding all the earth in fear, May he then, as our defender, on the clouds of heaven appear. Lord, Lord, send forth your light and your truth. Defend me, O God, and plead my cause against a godless nation. From deceitful and cunning men, rescue me, O God. Since you, O God, are my stronghold, why have you rejected me? Why do I go mourning, oppressed by the foe? O send for the light and your truth. Let these be my guide. Let them bring me to your holy mountain, to the place where you dwell. And I will come to the altar of God, the God of my joy. My Redeemer, I will thank you on the heart. O God, my God, why cast down my soul? Why groan within me? Up in God I will praise him still, my Saviour and my God. Praise the Father, the Son and Holy Spirit, both now and forever. The God who is, who was and is to come, at the end of the ages. Lord, send forth your light and your truth. Lord, come to our help all the days of our life. I said, in the noontime of my days I must depart. I am consigned at the gates of Sheol for the rest of my years. I said, I shall not see the Lord in the land of the living. I shall look upon man no more among the inhabitants of the world. My dwelling is plucked up and removed from me like a shepherd's tent. Like a weaver, I have rolled up my life. He cuts me off from the loom. From day to night you bring me to an end. I cry for help until morning. Like a lion, he breaks all my bones. From day to night you bring me to an end. Like a swallow or a crane, I clamour, I moan like a dove. My eyes are weary with looking upward. O Lord, I am oppressed, be my security. Lo, it was for my welfare that I had great bitterness. But you have held back my life from the pit of destruction. For you have cast all my sins behind your back. For Sheol cannot thank you, death cannot praise you. Those who go down to the pit cannot hope for your faithfulness. The living, the living, he thanks you, as I do this day. The Father makes known to the children your faithfulness. 
the Lord will save me, and we will sing to stringed instruments all the days of our life at the house of the Lord. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Lord, come to our help all the days of our life. To you our praise is due in Zion, O God. To you our praise is due in Zion, O God. To you we pay our vows, you who hear our prayer. To you all flesh will come with its burden of sin. To heavy for us our offences, but you wipe them away. Blessed is he whom you choose and call to dwell in your courts. We are filled with the blessings of your house, of your holy temple. You keep your pledge with wonders, O God our Saviour. The hope of all the earth and of far distant isles. You uphold the mountains with your strength. You are girded with power. You still the roaring of the seas, the roaring of their waves, and the tumult of the peoples. The ends of the earth stand in awe at the sight of your wonders. The lands of sunrise and sunset you fill with your joy. You care for the earth, give it water. You fill it with riches. Your river in heaven brims over to provide its grain. And thus you provide for the earth. You drench its furrows. You level its oven with showers. You bless its growth. You crown the year with your goodness. Abundance flows in your steps. In the pastures of the wilderness it flows. The hills are girded with joy. The meadows covered with flocks. The valleys are decked with weeds. They shout for joy as they sing. Give praise to the Father Almighty, to His Son, Jesus Christ the Lord, to the Spirit who dwells in our hearts, both now and forever. Amen. To you our praise is due. In Zion, O God. Judah shall not want a branch from his stem, a prince drawn from his stock, until the day comes, until the day when he comes, who is to be sent to us, he the, he the hope of the nations. The glory of the Lord will shine on you, Jerusalem, like the sun he will rise over you. The glory of the Lord will shine on you, Jerusalem, like the sun he will rise over you. His glory will appear in your midst. The glory of the Lord will shine on you, Jerusalem, like the sun he will rise over you. 
Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. The glory of the Lord will shine in Jerusalem, like the sun he will rise over you. Rejoice and be glad, daughter of Zion. Behold, I am coming to live in your midst, says the Lord. Blessed be the Lord, the God of Israel. He has visited his people and redeemed them. He has raised up for us a mighty Saviour in the house of David his servant, as he promised by the lips of all men, those who were his prophets from of old, a Saviour who would freeze from our foes, from the hands of all who hate us. So his love for our fathers is fulfilled, and his holy covenant remembered. He swore to Abraham our father, to grant us a tree from fear, and say from the hands of our foes we might serve him in holiness and justice all the days of our life in his presence. As for you, little child, you shall be called a prophet of God the Most High. You shall go ahead of the Lord to prepare his ways before him, to make known to his people a salvation through forgiveness of all their sins, the loving kindness of the heart of our God, who visits us like the dawn from on high. He will give light to those in darkness, those who dwell in the shadow of death, and guide us into the way of peace. Give praise to the Father Almighty, to His Son, Jesus Christ the Lord, to the Spirit who dwells in our hearts, both now and forever. Amen. Rejoice and be glad, daughter of Zion. Behold, I am coming to live in your midst, says the Lord. In a world divided by fear and greed, the Church calls again on her Saviour. Come, Jesus, to to us in love. Help us to set our hearts where they will find fulfilment and not betrayal. Lord Jesus, come to us in love. As we proclaim your saving power to others, let us not ourselves lose hold of your salvation. Lord Jesus, come to us in love. May our world be flooded with the grace of your coming. Let us experience the fullness of your joy. Lord Jesus, come to us in love. May we live our lives to the full in this world and transfigure it with the hope of future glory. Lord Jesus, come to us in love. At the Saviour's command, and formed by divine teaching, we dare to say, Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name, thy kingdom come. Thy will be done on earth 
as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Lord God, all the ends of the earth have seen your salvation. Give us the grace to await with joy the glorious day of our Saviour's birth. Through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, God, forever and ever. Amen. The Lord bless us and keep us from all evil and bring us to everlasting love.